I gotta tell you, Charles over in shipping is wondering why it is we're getting big chunks of dry ice sent to the studio, and the truth is, I have absolutely no idea. But you know, yep. David Willie, good to see you. Hi, Dad. What's with all the dry ice? Well, what we're gonna do is we are gonna actually burn magnesium in dry ice. Now, dry ice is solid carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide is commonly used in fire extinguishers to extinguish fire. And instead, we are gonna use it to cause fire. Now, Wait, this you're is... gonna use carbon dioxide to cause a fire? I thought yeah. fires use oxygen. Yep. Well, there's oxygen in carbon dioxide. Right? Okay. Carbon dioxide. And ah. magnesium, which is what the metal is that I've got here in this cup, that wants the oxygen so badly that once we light it, it'll actually draw the oxygen out of this carbon dioxide and leave carbon behind. Prove it. Prove it? Okay. Very first thing we've got to do is make an impression in this piece of dry ice so here prove. to be able to put this carbon dioxide in. You're wearing glasses. I'm going to put some safety glasses on. And let's start cutting a hole in there. Now, how cold, how cold is dry ice? Dry ice is about 78.5 degrees below the freezing point of water. Negative 78.5 degrees centigrade, 109 degrees. Negative 109 degrees Fahrenheit, minus 109. Now, I'm just going to get a nice hole here. So you, why are you making this hole again? Well, I'm going to put magnesium in there, but I want the two pieces of dry ice. See, that one's got a flat surface. Oh, yeah. This one's got a flat surface. I want those flat surfaces against each other because what I don't want is oxygen to get in here. I don't want that magnesium to be burning in the oxygen. I want it, as I said, to be burning in the dry ice. So we'll just keep hammering here. And let some of this out now. Let's see how big a hole we've got there. Oh, we're getting there. It's about the there. size of a baseball. All right, so the idea is that we fill magnesium into the hole and then seal it. And well, then burn set it, it on fire and, and, and then seal it. Then seal it. Oh, now, what I do gloves. have to do. Yep. What are you doing with a saw? I need a little groove in here because when this burns, gas is going to be formed and I want it to have a vent channel. Okay. So just put a little groove right here. It doesn't need to be hold very that for big. You? Oh, that would help a lot. Thank you. And there we go. This out of the way. It's like blowing on it because it makes all that smoke. I feel like I'm Isn't Michael Jackson. <laughs> you could be in a horror movie with this stuff. In fact, I believe they've used this in horror movies when you want to make fog. Okay, so we've got that. And okay, let me do this. You don't have gloves. Let me do that. Okay. Now, when you're ready, you put that on top. Now, I'm going to put... So wait, wait. So let me do a practice here. So th okay. this is going to make a, a, a flat yeah. seal. Flat seal. Uh-huh. You good? Yeah. Okay. So we put the magnesium this is a in. Terrible idea. Okay. And well, a little much there. It's because I want that piece to sit flat on top. Yeah. That... And if I may, are you sure you don't have too much in there? You? It looks like we got a little more than. Oh, if little is good, big is better. So man, am I the only one scared this? of fire? Okay, okay, okay. Burn it. Burn burning. Burn. You put the dry ice on top. There. And See. there. Let me move that. And you look Whoa. at how bright that gets. That's, that's close to the same brightness as the sun. And very hot. And now, pretty much done. Now what, why was it so, what, I don't, it was so bright. Yeah. Was it bright because of the dry oh, ice? or was No, it bright it's bright be because of the magnesium and the temperature which the magnesium burns at. So what was the dry ice doing? It was, it the would have dry been ice was providing the oxygen. The, car, the dry ice is carbon dioxide, and uh, the magnesium wants the oxygen so much that it actually pulled the oxygen out of the carbon dioxide. And once that's finished, which it is just about now, I'm thinking... So wait, we should see... If you take the top off... Wait, what are we going to find in there? Well, I'm hoping what we'll find is probably some water that's been turned into ice. But we might see some black in there as well. You see how it's black and white? Oh, yeah. The white's the ice, the black is the carbon. 
So you turned turn the percent. carbon dioxide into oxygen and, and carbon, carbon. And then yeah. burned off the oxygen with, with the, magnesium the magnesium and left carbon. Yeah, and you see all that black? That's the carbon from the carbon dioxide. That is the least safe thing I've done all day. It's always a pleasure. Thanks a lot. You're welcome.